Hello everyone, and welcome to the video. Today I'm going to be uh, unboxing, or at least, or unbagging, this pen that I have right here. And I'm also going to do a couple of shoutouts. So with that said, let's get into the video. First off, I'm going to start with some channels who I've done sticker swaps with. The first one is Big E's Knives, and right now he is getting close to the 1,000 subscriber mark, so if you can, go and if you aren't already, go subscribe to his channel. He has a lot of great case knives over there. He's just a really great guy and really fun to watch. So yeah, go check out his channel, and thank you Big E for the stickers. And I also want to say thank you to RDS, Wood Turning, and Acrylics for doing a sticker swap with me recently as well. Thank you for that. So, next I also have a few channels who are both close to the 500 subscriber mark. The first one is Brian over at Brian's Knives. He is pushing for the 500 subscriber mark right now. And then also, Aaron over at 865 Knives. He is really close to the uh, 500 subscriber mark. So if you can, go check out both of those channels as well and give them a subscribe if you're not already subscribed to their channels already. And with that, let's get into this bag here. First, I'm going to have to try to figure out how to open this thing without damaging anything in the packaging. I think if I just go across there, that should do it, I think. Oh yeah, that should be fine. Just like that. And what's kind of nice is this, my backdrop here is actually a cutting board, so it's not bad if I uh, actually do some cutting on it. Oh, and this this stuff is really tough. There we go. Let me make sure that there's nothing on the inside. I don't want you to see. Okay. Alright, so first off, uh, there's also, so this is who it's from. Uh, it's from Bobby over at RDS Wood Turning and Acrylics. And let me get this out of here. There we go. Yeah, there's his, if you want to pause that and read that, if you want to check out his uh, channel over there and his, check out the stuff he makes. He makes some really great pens and also got these right here. Got some, he makes lanyard beads and these are pretty neat. They have my channel logo on them. So, whoop, oh, yeah, that's the problem with round things. They roll, but there you go. There's pens and pen blades. And I also want to say thank you to uh, Bobby for helping me with this logo here. Because I didn't have a logo with my channel name on it. And he helped me put that together, or at least he put that together and I just approved it. So thank you Bobby for putting that together for me. And that's also, so yeah, those are the beads. And before I forget it and before I move on to the pen here, uh, let me show you, because I also had purchased, I had also made another purchase from Bobby and bought a few other pens, which will be coming, which I will, the video will be coming out about those fairly soon, but I also bought this uh, lanyard bead here, and it's an antler lanyard bead, which is really neat, and I actually have a knife that I think will go perfectly on this, that it's my uh, Para 2, Spyco PM2, with the snakeskin scales, I think that will fit that really nicely. So there's that, and without further ado, let's get into the pen here. Let me see if I can... I don't want to ruin pen or anything, but let's see if I can get to that tape there. Already I've seen... And I have seen pictures of this pen, so this is not the first time I uh, first time seeing it, I have seen it, but I have not seen it in person, and oof. That is... That is really cool. With that green wood and then the golden accents there. The golden silver, I like that two-tone look there, it's really cool. And this is a... Ooh, that action is really nice, nice and smooth. That is really nice. Look at the detail on that pen there, on the 
back and on the top. And then there's the my channel logo there. It looks really nice. And then the green and the, the brown background and then the pen. Uh, it just looks really nice. Yeah, it did a good job, Bobby. And I did I did buy this with my own money. I, the, um, just I want to say that just for uh, YouTube reasons. But yeah, just a really really nice job on the pen. Really cool. And that that pen, that mechanism is really smooth. It's really nice. Let's open it up and get to the uh, refill in here. Set that down there. And yep. Okay. So this is a this is a Parker style refill there. Really nice. Nice to have the spring there. So that's how that works. And you know what? Hang on, guys. Uh, oh, hang on. That's right. Parker have the have those uh, slots on them. I assume you need to slot those into. There we go. Yeah, slot them in the pen. Yeah, I gotta be careful about that little ring there. It can come off. Yeah, just screw that. Screw that back on. Yeah, really nice. And hang on, guys. Well, I'm gonna be right back. All right, I'm back. Just got some paper because. Of course, I get all ready and forgot one thing, but I just wanted to try out this. Oh, nice. It's a really nice smooth pen. The pen feels really good in the hand. I like that. It's a nice grip right there, and I like the texture there, actually. But it's a good, good size grip. It really fills the hand up, which is really nice. That's a nice smooth pen. Or a refill, I should say. Yeah, it feels really nice. Really satisfying action. That twist mechanism, that's really nice. Really like that. There's one more look at the pen. After I uh, finished the filming the video, I realized I forgot to show the back of the pen, which has this nice ornate detail on the back here. I don't know if you can see that very well with the light how it is, but yeah. That's one thing I missed uh, about the pen, is that little detail on the back. Yeah, and I also wanted to say uh, thank you, Bobby, for making this pen a reality and putting it together for me. But yeah. I think that's pretty much going to do it for this video here. And let me just bring out the channel stickers one more time here. And then there's the uh, Bobby's card if you would like to get anything from him. And uh, before I let you go, there's one more shout out. And it is RH Blades and. Uh, sorry, let me say that again. RH Blade and N, the letter N, Shade. And I'll put it up on the screen for you too, but he is a relatively new channel that I have just discovered. So if you can, go check out uh, his channel. He's got a lot of great knife content over there and stuff. But yeah, I think that's going to do it for now. Thank you all for watching. Keep your pens filled and your knives sharp. I'll see you later.